Hello and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be looking at, at the pricing of classic albums and modern albums in a certain rec record collector's collection. What we're going to do here is we're going to make our own equation, and then we're going to compare it to the equation that's given. Okay, so the total spending we know is $750. And that consists of classic albums and modern albums. So the spending on modern plus the spending on classic is going to equal to that total of $750. Now, how are each of these broken up? Okay, because this is starting to look like these terms, all right? So spending on modern, that's going to be the number of modern albums times the price of one. All right? And the spending on classic is going to be the same. It's the number of classic albums times the price that he paid for each one. Now we know what our variables are in this situation. All right, he has C classic albums, so that's this C right here. He has M modern albums, that's this number right here. And somehow, this is going to have to get us to the equation that's already given. We specify that this is a modern price of one classic is equal to that same $750. If we can write this down here, 35, add that plus 35C plus 20M is equal to $750. And you see that this lines up. Okay? So the C's line up, the M's line up. It's a little out of the order, but that's okay. Equals $750 adds up. So now what is it? What is multiplied by C? 35, the price of one classic. See how this lines up now? What is multiplied by M? Price of one modern, or 20. So now we know, by connecting these two, a modern is $20, a classic album is 35. How much more does one classic album cost than one modern album? That's just the difference between them. It's $35 minus $20 is equal to $15, which is going to be your answer, 15. As always, thank you for liking, subscribing, and I'll see you in the next video.